This is a $5 shield. And these three competitors are gonna be making $500 shields. The last shield standing will win $10,000. What sets you apart from them? Jack. <laughs> they just don't have the gusto. You know, they don't got the secret sauce. I would say the planning, but uh, one of the other contestants has clearly done a lot more planning than I have. So, a few days, you know, I, the tools I need. Some of the stage, you see like, you know, the, 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 I saved him about $50. I know that the concrete board, I think, was a great idea. Plus the three rolls of duct tape. Yeah, I watched a few YouTube videos about uh, historical shield building. I'm here to pretty much kill it. I brought my cat, which I killed that earlier. They told me I could get money, so I'm here for money. You already thought about what you're gonna do with this money. It'll probably go to my wife. Yeah, you know, probably feed my kids and uh, take care of my family. All right, Smith, so welcome. So today you're going to be making a shield in your signature style. You have three hours to do this, and your time starts now. So Will, what's your plan? I lay out the shape, uh, get my arm positioned where I think is going to be most efficient, lay out the template, trace it onto the uh, the board, and then uh, go from there. How's she coming? What's your plan? Going well so far. This is actually the test shield. I think I'm going to opt for the half inch thickness for the full shield. Let's see what our <clears throat> third contestant has. Yeah, uh, what's, what's the measure? What's the measurements again? Don't just just to make steps. sure. Well, I do, but I... I <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll leave you to it. All right, so let's start with Will. Will seems like he got a really solid idea. He's like, he's His really design. being precise. Mm -hmm. He's creating tools for himself. My biggest fear though, this might be true, but how much time is he going to spend prepping yeah. instead of actually getting Building into through. it? Where you got Alec right now, who's already done. Well into his yeah. build. He has a good rough shape where he could just drill some holes in it. Be done. And then there's Ellie. I, he lives to he, his channel name of Endless Shambles. Yes. He's, he's making some progress. I mean, he's, he's and he is being very specific about the parameters. But he has so much material he's got to get through. He's not yeah. even through his first cut. It's looking rough. I've been working for an hour, and I have $100 for whoever wants to test their shield. What's the test? Three wax with a bat. Whoever's confident in their shield and wants to test it, I got $100. Go for it. Go for it? Alrighty. So Alec has chose for us to test his bat to earn $100. Brent, walk in with the bat. No <laughs> need. Oh, Mark, Mark, was that what you were expecting? <laughs> <laughs> Alec done left. He couldn't watch. I can't watch. I can't watch. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my baby. <laughs> Alec, that's your three wax. Here's your hondo. Oh, sweet. Is that a... What is this? What is this? Uh, a a grill? spare grill top. That is very creative. Yeah, on sale. How are you attaching this to the wood? Nails? Uh, screws. Glue. And got any tape. Oh. Got the chisel technique. Yeah, right now they're just uh, plastered this way for a, a little bit of uh, adhesion, and then uh, I'll work on the, the holder next. It's not bad. It's like 10, 15 pounds. Alec is done. He's still deliberating. Yeah, we're almost really an hour. I really wish we could have seen him put that half inch in. I think it's going to make a big difference with the, how much that bat went into it with just the nails alone. That half inch could make a huge difference to not have a shield critically fail. Well, yeah, and we know some of the tests coming up, the sledgehammer, the piercing, that half inch really could have helped them out there. So we're about halfway through this competition. Now we're going to make this contestant spin this wheel. The wheel has different punishments and rewards on it, and whatever they land on, they got to keep. Spin the wheel, man. Good and bad. Grinder. Okay, you get a grinder. You get an extra 10 minutes. Sweet. Give it a, give it a spin. Sander. All right, I can use a sander. It's all these Ungodly toys. Long. Yeah. All these toys that we can't use. Maybe we just start your, like we erase. <laughs> erase. Well, we got all these tools here, and we didn't really like the last round of spin the wheel, so we're uh, we're gonna mix it back up for them a little bit. Round two of the wheel, boys. I'm still trying to get the fucking handle. On. <laughs> yeah, you guys fucking yeah. suck. Is this like all bad? It is all bad. 
Crowbar. Y'all got too lucky last time. Crowbar. All oh, crowbar. Y'all some lucky <laughs> Ooh, get shot. Eat it. Easy, easy, easy. It didn't even get to the concrete. Sorry, I have to do this. Yeah, look. <laughs> the poor drawing. It's a Florida leaf. A Florida leaf. Shit. Oh. All right, she held up pretty good. Reinforcements, pretty solid. I am a professional. Purchase It held pretty well. Oh shit! Yeah, metal. Well, no, no, I I didn't put the bolts back on when I loosened <laughs> up the thing. That's okay. Good job on the holding. All right, Smith, you got ten seconds left. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Time is up. Oh, equipment down! That is the end of this build! Surprisingly, stuff like this tends to not go according to plan, and this went as smoothly as it could have. I got the general shape was what was on my paper. Layering became an issue. I had to subtract a layer. I mean, it feels un indestructible. Don't tell them this, but if they go at it, it, it can get through the bars of the, the grill and potentially separate. If it involves holding the shield up and holding it for a normal amount of time, then I'm feeling pretty confident. If it's just hitting it with hard stuff, then uh, it might not be so hot. I win. I win. Penetration, I don't have a worry. Bat was covered in nails. They were like, all right, we're gonna hit it with the crowbar because I spun the wheel. And uh, <laughs> did a number on my shield. I didn't even have the duct tape around it. Uh, I thought it was just a regular old wooden bat. I have more reinforcement to front. All right, contestants. You guys have spent the last three hours designing and building these shields, but your judges are a little clumsy. Will's shield, did it take any damage? Will's shield only still has damages from the previous test, minus the handle was dented in a little bit more. Otherwise, what I thought was the LED explosions must have been some airsoft pellets on the floor, because as you see, every LED is still active. No right. damages on this. Very well done. Moving on to Elliot. We got really no damage to speak of. It kind of landed on its back, so it didn't uh, really take much damage. We're... I thought I saw a crease here, though. Yeah, we... It looks like it. I there thought was it was a little bit of a crease out. forming, but all in all, solid. Yeah. Easy, easy. Not even worried about it. Alex, looks like <laughs> everything. Nothing. Held up. Yep. Very well. Got a oh, we got a little bit of. Oh, yeah, handles. Screw. Yeah, screw. Little. We got we move some screw here. here. Other than that, very well done. Yeah. Good job, guys. All right, contestants. Throughout history, many shields have had to withstand bows. So today, we are going to test your guys' shields up against this crossbow. Uh oh. that out. Nope. <laughs> Not exactly what I expected, yeah. but it still did perfectly fine. All right, Elliot. So let's see what type of damage this thing did to your shield, man. So we definitely have full uh, penetration. Yeah. Yeah, I mean it just barely came out though. I think mm. I did. I think I did pretty all right. Oh, truthfully, I think he'd be he'd be hurt, but it did stop him. So, pretty it, will not kill. it will it not will kill. kill. <laughs> yes! I'm a little bit nervous on this one too. I was getting ready to run. Woo. It bounced off! That's what I'm talking about. That one stuck. 
All right, so let's see how Will's shield held up. It's looking very promising. There is absolutely no poking through. Completely solid back here. And as you can see, I mean, this one just completely broke off. This one, it just shove, it just literally just shoves the tip right through the, the shaft of this guy here. This will protect. Firing. Oh, 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 shit, he missed the fletching. See what the metal does? Oh, man. Down to the fletching. So, upon examination, you would be dead. Whoa, buddy. I mean, arrows, they took some damage, but <laughs> I'm dead. My baby. <laughs> so this test is to see how strong they can withstand a shield normally able to hold up against a horse? This is my horse! He's called Hammer. Let's go. I want to be ninja. I want to be ninja. I want to chop, 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 chow down. Take chow down to Chinatown. I want to be ninja. I started training hard. The only thing I see damage-wise done to the shield is we got an indent on the first hit, but nothing too severe. Held up like a shield should. It'll hold against a horse. Dude, I thought that I thought the length was gonna kill me. What do you mean by that? Ooh. Oh my god! Oh. Yep, that happened. <laughs> not too late for that. I was not expecting yeah. that. <laughs> Yeah. One more time. There it is. Hey, the oh LEDs are God. still on. Okay. This shield will not withstand a horse. It split all the way cleanly through. I can almost remove an arrow from it. <laughs> and oh, it just yes. bent it to hell and snapped. The light still works. Hey, at least it'll go out pretty. Yeah. Cool. yeah. Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright. Okay. It bowed and bend and cracked, but did not break all the way through. There's a couple of screws loose, but it will withstand a horse. Therefore, She'll hold. All right, guys, this is the final test. You guys spent all day forging these, and now I'm gonna test them with fire. All right, Smith, now that we've tested all your shields, we will deliberate and find out who the winner is. So, all right, so. Alex didn't do good in the piercing. The piercing. Sledge? Wheels well, took an unexpected a turn. Unexpected turn. The drop sure. all passed. They all passed the drop. And the flamethrower did any damage really? It didn't really do too much damage. It did some outer outer damage, but nothing in, in you know, integral. Elliot's got a little Elliot's, bit of Elliot's awesome did flame. the best with both the piercing and the hammer. As well as it's still functional. But I, Alex dead, Will dead. At least still stand. Right, we have a we got position. It. Okay. Alrighty guys, we have deliberated. There can only be one winner. And that is Elliot. Congratulations. Your shield is still standing and you Not are still anymore. alive. Yes. Alex, <laughs> unfortunately. The piercing did you in. You're dead. Will can't handle blunt, but you're dead. Alright, Elliot. You won, so congratulations. Here is your prize. Thank Good you. Good work. Thank you. Congratulations, Elliot. And if you guys want more of this content, please click these videos right here. Like and subscribe for a cup of tea.